Welcome to my second uh, part of the uh, first attempt to make uh, to make you see how I work exactly. And in the, in the previous uh, upload, I decided to draw a face into the image that I uh, drew in negative and then uh, made the face. But then, of course, I was talking to you or to me, to myself, actually, but trying to uh, document this. And then when I closed that video, when I was done with it, I, I worked on the artwork itself. And now you see something very different coming out. So what I see now is, uh, without thinking, I just drew this. And then uh, the last part was this. Uh, so this, of course, making it look like a skull of maybe a reindeer or whatever. And then I remembered, hey, it looks a bit like uh, the Picasso painting of the ox. I can show you here um, and what I what I find so it's one of the the artworks uh, I like most of Picasso I think uh, what I like so much about it it's it's a bit of a dinosaur uh, kind of skull also especially the part with the jaws the jaws which are also very important to to us uh, humans uh, not only for chewing but also for thinking um, and it's just the color combination it's just so beautiful and so um yeah it, it does a lot to me and um also i see i've been in mexico uh, a couple times and i see many artists also draw uh, skull figures so it's a combination of being inspired by picasso in this work and also uh, my trips to mexico that has uh, that have inspired me further so let me just show you a bit then again, how I'm going to make this look more like a skull. And then, of course, my computer loading, which is always very nice if I have the mind, if my mind wants to continue and the computer doesn't. It's definitely time for a new computer. So, but first I need to sell art. <laughs> so, um, let's see this. Yeah. There's no need to always follow the lines. Uh, creativity starts when you don't follow the lines, I think. All right. Um, then the question, of course, am I going to keep the jaw this color or change it a bit? A bit more to yeah also what is amazing about using Photoshop is that you can uh, easily step away from the painting you know you know the artists who are always sitting in front of their painting <laughs> or at least that's what they show in movies and uh, in some images of course but with Photoshop you can just you know take many steps back with just uh, some clicks on the keyboard um, I think I like the green better. Let's see what, what happens if I make it. Yeah, I like this. I like the yellowish part also, I think. Yeah, I think this is cool. Maybe there's even a bit of Basquiat in this, this artwork also. Can happen because I've, I've been checking some documentaries on him too. Uh, and of course, already knew his work for some time. Absolutely love his uh, his style and his uniqueness, and also the fact that he didn't care so much about uh, the whole art world. He was just doing the things that he loved, and uh, I think that's yeah, that's inspiring, definitely. Um, let me continue here a bit with the artwork without talking about <laughs> stuff. I'm sorry, I do that a lot. Um, no. no. Maybe just blending it and giving it a bit of outer glow. 
actually fine like this, I guess. Um, I would like to put an eye in it, and I think I'm going to choose a different part of the eye for this one. Yeah, that looks kind of cool, actually. Uh, it fits it, I think. sure about the eyebrows it needs some color around it let's see how this what this will do You. Y O U. Let's see if I put the eyebrows here. Ah, that <laughs> that's kind of cool, but maybe I have to change the color. Yeah, makes more sense. But then again, I'm also not sure if I'm gonna keep it. Yeah, choices, choices, choices. Uh, Okay, 
and I'll just save this version and uh, the version without the eyebrows. Uh, I can choose about that later. Just wanted to show you the, the second outcome of uh, me playing with uh, the image that I drew and scanned in or photographed and put into Photoshop. Yeah, I of course hope it inspires you a bit. Of course, showing you the Picasso artwork, which is already uh, a reason to, show, to uh, see this video because of course he's one of the biggest, uh, biggest artists. Um, so if you have any uh, thoughts on how uh, how I created this, or you wanna, uh, yeah, uh, express your ideas or anything you, you think about this this work, uh, Udo is always nice to uh, to hear what people think. So again, I say bye bye bye. Actually, I never said bye 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 before, but uh, <laughs> it's just funny. Bye.